just drop by my office. Dip I don't want to drop by your office. At least one of us around. I'm the therapist now. I am the therapist. Look at me. Look at me. This your first I'm shift the at the center? What? Well, it's a great place to work, and I'm sure you'll fit right in. What the f- <laughs> Alright, so I don't actually know much about this mission. I don't remember much of it at all. So I'm just gonna play this by ear and go see what it is I need to do. Oh look, a guy is exercising. That's that's great. The not so nice one. He kind of looked like an albino. He was scary though. That's racist. Nurses don't wear those white hats and the white dresses anymore. I happen to know. I am a nurse. That's literally what I do, and we literally don't wear that. Like ever. Look at me now. Agent 47 has never looked so sexy. Gonna have to search you, sir. Oh shit. Hold on. Now I could sneak in and everyone would think I'm supposed to be there, right? But then they don't have to search me for weapons, though. Because I want my weapons. That's like my basic right as an American citizen. To have uh, a silenced pistol, an AP mine, a sedative syringe, a poisonous syringe and a death serum, <laughs> serum syringe and an antidote. Oh, and fiber wire. Just basic American rights. Damn it, I got cut. I don't think you should be here. Really? No, I'm totally allowed here. Dr. Uh, Dingo said that I was allowed to walk around on the roof. If you don't leave right now, I'm calling the cops. But I was it's a prescription. I have I have the paper. Right here. Oh, oh, oops, that's the wrong paper, I'm sorry. Oh, look. Go ahead and cook with it. I definitely didn't tamper with it. Oh, no. That was unexpected. Hi there, Craig Thurman. I'm the on-call therapist. A lot of the clients here find it's helpful to have someone to talk to. I'm always available if you need an ear. Just drop by my office. How do you know who I am? I guarantee Craig does not look like me. To just have his clothes, which happens to be the exact same outfit of everybody else who is a patient in this facility. How would you know that I'm supposed to be Greg? I don't have a name badge or anything, do I? No. I just have a face. I do my job very well. I am a sneaksy person. A sneaksy person who wears, like, bathrobes and slippers. I am the best assassin. Hi. You're a guard. Or are you a target? I don't even know. Whoa, who are you? You're a guard. Or are you a target? I don't know. Both look really grumpy, so you're probably both guards. Okay, let me spot you. Oh no, I'm doing it wrong. Oh. Uh... My bad. Sorry. Hi. You guys both look exactly the same. That's really weird. Hey, buddy. That's a really cool looking dress. It's pink. Buddy. I found your secret stash. I found it. Now you have two options here. You can turn yourself in. Or you can give it to me. Don't do it. You really shouldn't do it. <laughs> okay, that's what I thought. You walk away now. Oh no, it's another accident! Oh no! Look at what just happened here. On accident. You. No, he looks very much dead, actually. Alright, Greg, I added some extra incentive for you not to drink from your personal stash. You understand? Don't drink from it. We've talked about this. Greg, I, I, I'm warning you. You better not... Greg! We've talked about... Okay, Greg, you made a big mistake. Greg. I'm disappointed in you, Greg. I'm really disappointed in you. Yeah, that, that's what happens when you... When you break our agreement, Craig. I'm always available if you need an ear. Yes, yeah, screw you. If I'm not in, there's always at least one of wow, you are very well composed. You kept talking after I broke your nose.
the average day in the cop's life. Hmm. Agent 47 likes warm baths. Hmm. Oops. Something happened to this guy. Oops. Something happened to this guy too. This your first shift at the center? Yeah, you're so creepy. Gosh, your voice changes so much. No, it's not. Not when there's people like you who just suddenly change like that. Oh. So my own traps can't hurt me. Well, that's kind of disappointing. All right, let's talk to Agent. You. I should have. Oh, that's the American is dating me. Psychotropics. The things they've done. <sighs> Figures. They'd send you to clean up my mess. Th this is the guy. Here. I'm getting you out of here. They'll never let me out alive. I know. <laughs> He's not gonna explain that. Just yeah, I know. Death serum. No, oh, I got the death serum. Sedate agent. Ah. Identity obtained. Executing rest of assignment. Splendid, 47. It might interest you to know the following. A sudden shift in the delicate power balance of the New York families. Two low-level contracts just came in. In addition to your primary target, two members of the same group are currently staying at the facility. Yeah, I've already killed them all, though. Terminating either will result in a $50,000 bonus per head. It's entirely up to you. Yeah, I'm already done. I... Okay. You what? Revive, agent. Jabby jab. Why are you playing music as if I'm in trouble when there's nothing to be in trouble for? I just woke him up. And you had a really bad life. You should probably quit the CIA. Three accidents, no kills, no headshots, not count, not found, etc. And now I got Silent Assassin. It took me 11 minutes to do. Yay. Anyway, that's that. Y'all have a great day. And I, Mr. Blubberbutter. See you later. Bye.